Hello boys, in this tutorial I am going to show you how to create dark version of this render. First of all, my name is Textureman and if you want to support me hit the like button or hit the subscribe button and if you want to download this 3D model or 3D scenes, check out my Patreon page, link in the description. So let's start working on this dark version. First of all, I'm going to my camera view, I'm going to click on free camera and I'm going to make a little bit closer look on this something to like something to like this and i'm going to create new camera click on this and save the view if you missed the previous tutorials part number one and part number two you can find the link in the description and you can you can start basically from the scratch. We are going to change our environment. So I'm going to click on uh, the brand new environment. We want a lighting environment. And we are going to use for this 3D model something like, we are going to select these parts and we are going to use something to like um, paint gloss black or we are going to use ceramic. But we are going here to the paint metallic and we are going to use the shiny and we are going to apply this shiny material on this 3d object now we are going to the environment tab we are going to change our environment we need the solid color black we need the highest resolution and we are going to create our lightning so our first pin will be a little bit smaller it will be just the half of the size and we need fall off something like one and we are going to bring this light um i'm going to click on this and we are going to bring this light to the back side of the environment something to like this we want some kind of fall off effect so we are going to bring these value to the higher and maybe something to like this under 59 and this will be 11 and i'm also going to change these uh, views so we are going to work in the one by one aspect ratio and i'm going to zoom it a little bit more something to like this or something to like this i'm going back to my environment and we need to create the another pin so click on to create another pin we are going for the rectangular we are going to make this light a little bit bigger so something to like this we are going to rotate these light we are going to make this half and we are going to make the follow so one side of the light is soft and another is the hard and you can see it start looking really good we are going to bring this light more something to like this okay maybe i want to hit this edge so this is really good and we are going something to like this and much more down okay this is really nice you can see this reflection it looking really good i'm going to bring this light i'm going to make this light a little bit more brighter i'm going to duplicate this light and i'm just going to move it to the other side but mm, something to like this and maybe something like this and a little bit more higher this is really good
and maybe just a little bit more to the to the left side and more down i'm just trying to make it a little bit more interesting so you can see we got nice reflection around these case and also around the headphones so, uh sorry around these butts or free butts so it's really nice and i'm just going to create the another pin light so click to create another pin light this will be a little bit higher intensity will be much more brighter and i want also the fall of soft edges and i'm going to bring this light something to like this i'm trying to hit the spot right here but making it a little bit more interesting so i'm going to change these values right here this position so something to like this i'm going to bring this value down okay this is look really good you can see it start hitting this edge right here so this is this is really nice okay and i'm going to duplicate these light i'm going to bring it something to like this because we need to lighten this part as well and i'm going to bring up the intensity much more brighter and i'm going to make it a little bit more to the right side and a little bit more down Or I'm going to change it. Okay, and I'm going to actually bring these lights a little bit more down. Okay, so we can now see this part as well. And I'm going to click on this. So we render the full resolution of the HDRI. I'm going to click on done. And I'm just going to change these these uh plastic to make it a little bit more rough something to like this actually no i'm going to stick with this and yeah this is pretty much it i'm just going back to my environment and i'm just going to make this overall brighter and overall more contrast i'm going back to my hdri map and i'm going to click on this and i'm just going to play with these value okay this is too much okay this is good and maybe this will be a little bit bigger that's too much okay 18 looks really good and i'm also going to make some final adjustments so i'm just going to click on this button i'm just going to change this to the photographic and I'm just going for the linear style. This will be much more higher. Okay, something to like this. And a little bit more bluish. This is all right. And a little bit more contrast. And this is really nice. I'm going again render my HDRI. And you can see it's really looking good. And we create the answer lights and it's really nice. So I'm going to create the brand new camera and I'm just going to save this one. So I'm going to make sure it's in the middle. 
which is it so i'm just going to save this camera so it's good and i'm just going back to my free camera uh turn off this um grid mode and i'm just going to wait a little bit for the for the preview and i'm just going to show you when you got the good lightning you can really create anything with these key shot basic materials so check it out we can make it red and it still looks really good and we can also make the case red or we can go a little bit more fancy i'm going just the back and we can we can change these to something like i don't know let's try this okay this is not really good and <laughs> maybe carbon fiber okay we can make this carbon fiber we just need to change these these uh these um, scale of the material so i'm just going here and i'm just going to make these half size and also i'm going to check on click on this make this again half of the size again these half of the size and i'm going to check this and you can see it looks really nice and you got the carbon fiber version for example so i'm going back this is my final version so i'm going to render this and i'm going for the png uh, for the little bit higher resolution clown pad options 256 sample this will be the 16 i'm going to use the free 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 and these all will be checked on so guys thank you for watching if you like this video please hit the like button if you like it so much hit the subscribe button and if you want to download this 3d model check out my patreon page and you can download 3d model and also this finish it 3d scenes so guys have a nice day and have a nice render bye